Hi, this is the Biz and we are back with another beer and canning Ooh, from a local brewery, the Briar Bank. This one's called The Grounds for Divorce. It is a chocolate, coconut, and raspberry imperial porter. That's pushing in at 11%, and then you're just looking to leverage that off. And there you have it a nicely uncanned or unbottled beer. Grounds for divorce. I think we're in for a bit of a treat once again. So let's see as it pours. I think we could have possibly done this with a better hand. But I have been asked, um, because I'm Ipswich based, to mention the shop that I get these from. And the, all of the beers that I've done these for at the moment have come from an Ipswich shop called Hopster. So if you have the edge, please do give them a visit because as you can see they do some mighty fine beers and they also have some rather interesting spirits as well i think they have quite a range they're quite a friendly bunch and i do recommend your attendance so this is the poured porter oh that's a nice smell it, it definitely smells rich as well bottoms up let's see how it tastes The the uh, the raspberry and the the chocolate coconut as sharp is good. I mean, certainly if you like your sharp at beers, like you can feel it all there. It really is a complex, I guess. Just on a follow up on this one, this hits heavy. You know, this is not a beer for the faint of heart. The the coconut and the raspberry are really quite intense it has a big kick it's almost like a i think the chocolatey bit gives a um an odd tangy flavor because you get that raspberry really really brightly and then it sort of almost burns off in your tongue it's like I said, I don't think this one's for the faint of heart. I think this is, if you're going to drink it regularly, I think you will be on the way to becoming grounds for divorce. But it is really rather nice. Um, I keep saying that. I've also said that it's, mm, 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 mm. you know, uh, I'm not saying I'm not enjoying it, but I don't think it will be one that I will purchase myself again. But I have had great stouts from the Debrai Bank. I know they offer a large range. And this clearly is an effort for them to make something complicated. Um, and I think if you're after something complicated in your beer and you want to experience all these flavors, then this is a cracker. But I tend towards more the smooth. It, it, for me, it's pushed past sweet and into rich. But um, if it's the kind of beer that you like, if you like sharp beers, and you like dark beers then this is the one for you i mean it's really got everything that you could want if you like those things and i do still intend to enjoy it thank you for spending time with me i hope you've enjoyed this and i'm going to enjoy the rest of my um, grounds for divorce hope you have had a marvelous time and i shall see you soon ciao for now bye